Hello and welcome. This is Stephanie. I'm here at Crosstown Auto, your used car supercenter. Today we're going to be taking a look at the 2015 Dodge Grand Caravan SXT. Beneath that stylish hood, we have a 3.6 liter V6 engine. Coming on down, we've got honeycomb styling in the front here. And it, we've got our daytime running lights, of course. Underneath our fender flares, we're going to see that we're riding on top of 17 inch Kumho all weather tires. We've also got a mud flap here to minimize rock chips flying up and hitting the car behind you, of which I'm sure they will be quite grateful for. We've also got body side molding to protect you from dents and dings. As you can see, the inside is just as stylish as the outside. The black is a wonderful contrast to the red here. So why don't you come on with me and I'll step inside. Here we've got our remote unlock and remote lock key, but you'll notice that we also have a remote start. So if you press this twice, it beeps twice to let you know it's working and then it starts up. So why don't we step inside? All right, give me a moment just to get situated. All right, so let's come over here and take a look at our power options. We've got windows, mirrors, and locks. Coming around here, let's start the car up so you can take a look at the dash. So here we can see that this car is practically brand new. It only has 1,609 kilometers on it. I'm going to cycle through the displays with the step button. So here we've got trip B, so you can keep track of up to two trips for when you need to know just how far you went. It'll tell us ex approximately how fast we're going. And it'll tell us our current liters per 100 kilometer. It'll also tell us exactly how warm or cold it is outside so you can know whether you need your jacket or not. Very useful for these uh, weather, the changes in weather that can happen here in Alberta. So here we've got a few other buttons. The step button I was using to scroll through the display. The reset button is used to reset the trip mileage and the VR button can be used for voice recognition. Cancel! Pretty cool, huh? You can hook up your phone for hands-free calling so you can avoid a hefty ticket fine. Coming around the side, we've got our cruise control here, which we can raise or lower. And if we wrap our hands around the leather wrap steering wheel, we've got a volume control. If we wrap our hands around the other part of the steering wheel, we can change the station. Speaking of the station here, why don't we take a look at the touch screen. So here we are. There's another voice recognition button and calling button. But this is a touch screen as well. So you can use the radio button and you can navigate with the tap of a finger. We have AM, FM, and satellite radio. Pressing the media button, we see that we have a hard, hard drive in the car that you can upload your music and pictures to. We also have a disc player for CDs. If we press the slow button, we'll actually get a chance to see it. There we are, there's the CD drive. This, car, this vehicle is so new, this touch screen still has the shiny plastic on it. You can even see my reflection, hello. If we press the menu button, it'll give us system setup, nav setup. We can also set the display settings. Uh, we can turn the screen on, off. We can switch it to default view or we can set a background. Here we've got audio that we can, uh, <laughs> we can configure. We also have equalizer for bass, mid, and treble. So you can turn the bass, mid, treble up or down. If we press my files, you can see what music 
pi music and pictures you have there or ha or manage your hard drive. We've also underneath there we've got a USB slot. We've got an auxiliary in. Coming on down we'll see our tri-zone climate control. We've also got a fuel economy button, our hazard lights, and our traction control button, which we can use to turn the traction control off if we desire. Down here, we've got our cup holders, which can be tucked away safely to give you more space. Beneath that, we have more voltage, or sorry, power outlets. And in the middle here, we've got additional cup holders, which can be removed and and so they can be washed and to give you more storage space. And here we have a good view of the cloth seating. Very comfortable. Coming around the top, we've got our sunglass storage and an extra set of eyes. We've got our lights. And coming on back down, one last thing, we have two additional storage spaces and a lockable glove compartment. There's so many features I can't possibly talk about them all. Why don't we check out the back for some stow and go action. Here I am in the back of the vehicle. We've got our two comfortable captain's chairs. I've moved my driver's seat all the way forward in anticipation for the stow and go. I've made sure that this lever is pushed all the way in. Next, we're going to pull this. That'll stay up and it's nice and easy. All you have to do is pull this lever and it practically pushes itself in there for you. Just give it a gentle but firm push. And there you go. There's lots and lots of space. Speaking of space, why don't we go check out the back? So we've got these tinted windows for an extra level of privacy. And we're gonna check out the back here. Oh, it lifts up so nice and easy. I barely had to do anything. Sorry about that. I just had to set up the seat again. Here we are. We've got a 60-40 split between the back seats. We've got a lot of extra storage space and we've got bag hooks so you can hook on your groceries and you don't have to worry about them rolling around everywhere. We've also got a special storage space for your jack. Of course these back seats uh, stow and go as well so why don't we take a look. We pull these conveniently numbered little loops here. One, two, three, and Four. There we are. Look at all that space. There are actually 81 different configurations of stow and go seating. So something else that's super cool about this is you can even use it as a seat. You want to sit down, have a drink at a party or watching the soccer game. You can do that. It's nice and comfortable. Those cloth seatings that we know and love. Let's go ahead and close this. All right, that was the 2015 Dodge Grand Caravan SXT. Stow and go. As If you want to book your test drive, we're just a click or a call away. Thanks for walking around with me. This is Stephanie with Crosstown Auto. Have a great day.